Are you tired of this happening while taming an Equus? My name's Tekwursa, and I feel like I've done this before, but I know I can do it better this time, and if you stick around I'll tell you a couple of neat things about Equus. Since I mentioned Unicorn in the title, let's talk about them really quick. They're a rare variant of the Equus that shows up on the island in Ragnarok. There can only be one wild unicorn at a time, they're easy to startle, and they can only breed with other unicorns, but otherwise they're functionally identical to regular Equus. Now that I have that out of the way, let's prepare. The foods you're going to need in order from most effective to least effective. Regular kibble, rockerot, other crops, sweet vegetable cake, mijo berries, and then all other berries. I'd recommend using regular kibble or rockerot. It wouldn't hurt to have some other crops just in case. At a default taming rate, a level 50 can take between 20 minutes and 2 hours. A level 100 can take between 30 minutes and 3 hours. A level 150 between 40 minutes and 4 and a half hours. These times are the difference between Rockerot and the other types of crops. Kibble takes about a third of the time Rockerot uses. The recipe for regular kibble is 1 medium egg, 2 long grass, 2 savor root, 1 cooked meat jerky, five fiber, one water, in a cooking pot for about 30 seconds. Condition the area around the Equus. Kill off any carnivore that could interfere with your taming. You'll need to keep an eye on the one you want to tame while you do this, and if you have tribe mates to help you, they can be defending the area while you start taming. Put your taming food of choice in the last slot of your hotbar. Equus are easy to startle and will run away at the sight of the player. You'll need to sneak up behind them, and if you want to be extra careful, you can use a ghillie suit. It's especially useful if you're chasing a unicorn. If they do get startled, you'll need to back off and wait for them to calm down before you can try again. Once you're in range, interact with the Equus, then immediately interact again to ride the Equus. You need to interact with the Equus every time the Equus is about to buck you off. There are three indicators of this. The first is the Equus will stop running. Second is the Equus will jump and kick out its hind legs. Third, the taming status icon in the bottom right corner will light up and there will be text prompting you to interact to feed. This icon also lets you know the taming effectiveness and taming percentage the Equus is currently at. If you accidentally dismount, the Equus will lose 10% of both taming effectiveness and progress. If the Equus ever bucks you off, you'll be hit with a lot of topor damage and the Equus will start to run off. You'll also lose about 15% effectiveness in progress. However, if you keep it up, the Equus will be tamed. Now for the neat facts that I promised earlier. Remember, if this video was helpful, make sure you like and share it. Your support really helps out the channel. Equus can be ridden without a saddle. However, they do have a saddle which can be learned at level 20 and crafted in the smithy with hide, fiber, wood, and stone. The saddle acts as a mobile mortar and pedestal and gives you the ability to craft a lasso. More on those in a bit. The Equus have a carry weight reduction on cementing paste, clay, and the materials to make them. The primary attack of the Equus is nothing special. The secondary attack, however, is a rear buck that deals to a poor damage. Crouch is a rear up winnie. They can be carried by Argentavis, Wyvern, and Quetzal. If your server allows for carrying wild creatures, you could use this to help in taming. Let's not forget the lasso. The lasso is something special. It allows the Equus to drag creatures behind it. As far as I can tell, there isn't a comprehensive list of every creature that can be dragged by a lasso, but it seems to be limited to smaller creatures with a max drag weight of around 150. The creature you're dragging can either be asleep or awake. Did I mention they can also spawn as a unicorn? I swear that I did, but that's all I got for today. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and have yourselves... A very good day.